Hello everyone, Neon Jigglypuff here. Welcome back to another episode of Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door. In the last episode, we made it to the champion's room. That's right. We are now champions of the Glitz Pit. And we learned that there are actually strange noises coming from, you know, this room. Which means that this room is actually haunted, haunted because X told us to find the ghost in the champion's room. Oh, um... How exactly do we find a, uh... Ghost in here. Well, I'm gonna show you. Let's find that ghost. First, gonna have the platform on, on these presents. Flutter jump on the door. Flutter jump here. And then, well, wait. Oh, I see. Use your spinny hammer and bust down the. Oh, that was easy. Vent! <laughs> Walk down here. We're in the air duct, right? Where does it lead? I don't know. Hmm. Oh. Voices. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, that's in perfect condition as usual. Yep, as long as I got that baby working for me, this old bot ain't never gonna get weak. But I'm gonna have to watch my tootsies here for a little bit. At first I let that King K agent walk into me, but I was with that. And now I can't shake the feeling that Jolene and the Gonzales are onto me too. Well, I guess I'll burn that bridge when the time comes. I'll just disappear him. Yep. Just like I did to the others. Like the Prince Mush, the first champ. That voice. It's Grubba. So he's behind all the missing fighters? How about I lock this room up tighter than the peanut butter jar at a squirrel convention? And I'll just go ahead and hide this little paper plate into that in the desk drawer. There we go. You know what? It's since I'm thinking out loud here. Good fighters ain't nothing to mess with. Even Rockhawk lost a Gonzalez. This new champ might have to disappear pretty soon, for my sake. Oh my god. See what this means? This guy's really twisted, isn't he? I think he's gone. Let's check out that desk drawer of his. I will, but before I do that star piece in here, and I believe the other drawer has a star piece in it, too. Yep. Now let's go to this one. Whoa! Check it out, Mario! Oh. Yo! A machine under the ring using a crystal star? These are blueprints! I don't know what the rest of this nerd talk says, but I think the crystal star powers it. So if this paper's right, and the machine can suck the power out of people. Yuck! Oh, crud. You think that King K and Bandy Andy got all drained or something? Great galloping gulpits! How in tarnation did you get in here, son? Well, slap me and call me Sassafras. You're staring at my secret paper, too! Shut up! You make me sick! Why'd you drink King K and Bandy Andy, huh? Whoa, Nelly, this ain't good. Ashram Gonzalez, he's getting away! Jizz, this guy is absolutely Ooh. twisted. So now we know who's behind all this. Mr. Grubba, our freaking, like, manager the whole time. Or the owner of the Glitz Pit was behind all this. You know, there's only one thing to do, right? There's only one place we can go now. Remember what Bandy Andy warned us. Do not go in the ring when no one's around. And we're about to see why he said not to do that. Nobody's around. Don't go in the ring when nobody's around. The lights are still on. I gotta say, you're all a couple slack-jawed idiots sniffing around my business. Now you know my big secret. I'm afraid you're gonna take a little old dirt nap. This guy is absolutely twisted. I never knew a spike could do all this. He's a spike! You know, the guy from Mario Party 10? The green guy? This is him! Gonzalez, up there! That's the crystal star, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. How do you like my machine? Pretty dang nice, huh? Yep, I've been sucking power from fighters with this beauty. You're darn tootin', and you know why? Because it keeps my body. Forever young, son. 
You are such a scumbag! You're gonna pay for using a crystal star like that! Oh, just shut your traps now! I'll use my crystal star however I dang please! Check this out! <laughs> Muscle up! Macho Grubber! Yo! Grubber beefed up! Oh, I'm gonna smoosh you guys in the guacamole and snack on your energy too! Alright guys, we made it. This is the final boss of Chapter 3. Macho Grubba. Someone we thought was our friend the entire time and turned out to be the main enemy of the, of the chapter. This is why I love this chapter so much. This plot twist is amazing. The person that we knew as a friend the entire time turned out to be the main villain. The main villain has been right with us the entire time we thought him as an ally. Let's rock, Gonzalez! I'm ready to chew this dude and spit him out! You can't believe this fight. Macho Grubba. Here's the thing. Yoshi, I would love to use you right now, but unfortunately I'm gonna have to swap you out. Or... Alright, Swap Gumbella, I'm gonna need you to tattle this guy. Tattle Macho Grubba. That's Macho Grubba. He's Grubba all souped up on Crystal Star Power. Max HP is 60, attack is 4, defense is 0. His attack patterns are simple. First he increases the number of times he can attack. Then he powers himself up with all sorts of power up moves. Increased power up moves. So it's pretty important to stay close attention to how he's powered himself up. The craziest thing about this muscle head is that he used to be that chubby grubba. I guess the crystal stars really are powerful. You were right about that, Goombella. This guy is no joke. He has a whopping 60 HP, and he can attack more than once this turn. He attacks once, and then he, like, first he buffs his stats, and then he'll attack you. So he's no joke. You want to be very, very, very careful when you fight this guy. I am going to do Super Hammer. Four damage, not bad. Now what's going to do? He buff- wait, no, is he attacking? No, he's- now he can actually attack twice now, so he's actually, um, buffing himself. Goombella, I'm gonna swap you out for Dez. And now Dez, you can, um, you can ground pound him for now. Rapidly press R. We got it, pretty easy. And... That's like six damage, right? No, only four? Oh, because he hasn't, um, upgraded yet. Alright, we don't have any items. Maybe I should have been prepared for this. Ooh, this is not good. I have the power of the crystal stars on my side. Um, we should do clock out on it. Wait, it might not even work. That's the thing. It may work, but it may not, because on uh, bosses, sometimes it works, and sometimes it doesn't. It's just, it all depends. Why is there a shy guy here? Um, why is there... I'm, I'm getting really nervous right now. Oh! Nope, the shy guy ruined it, I think. His defense went up by three, and now he's gonna attack us. Yoshi? Oh! Oh, he attacked me! Okay. There's an X not there. I don't know why you're trying to do that for. Okay. Swap. Okay, I'll go in front and protect Dez. Um, what are we gonna do here? Spin jump. Oh, he's a, oh, his defense went up. I shouldn't have wasted that. Ooh. Shouldn't have wasted that. Uh, let's see. All I can do is appeal. I'll just get more star power. So we can attack him later on. What's he gonna do? Attack? Attack went up by three. Now he's really, really powerful. Okay, he'll only do this for one more... Or two more turns. Ooh, six! Oh, God. This is not good. Um... All right, since we can't heal, you know, we can heal right now. I gotta do it. I should have bought more items. I should have been prepared for this. I was not thinking. Okay, aim for Yoshi and FP. That's what we need the most. Yoshi and FP, or Dez, I mean, not Yoshi. Dez. Wait, Poison Shroom? Okay, we're doing good so far. We're doing well, I mean. Oh, throw him, throw him. Okay, we did, that's fine, that's good. Alright, 
now Yoshi. I mean Dez. I gotta get used to calling you Dez. Golf. Oh. Boom. Four. Good. What's he doing? Oh, he's dodging now. This is not good. Now he can. We can miss our attacks. I mean. Oh. Okay. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna charge myself. Attack went up by two. Good. And then Des, you're gonna sit out for a little bit, and I'm gonna call Flurry. Haven't seen you for a little bit. And then Flurry, you can use Body Slam. Alrighty. Alrighty, I said alrighty, wow. Alright, you're doing well. I need a tank out here, so I gotta. Oh yeah! Keep it spicy! You know I love a good tussle, Gonzalez! Keep on scrapping, son! Of course you ain't gonna do much good in the end! No, we're gonna beat you. Pause. I just realized he turned orange. He went from blue to orange. Oh, is he speedy now? I don't know what the hell he did. Alright. Flurry, you're a tank, so you... Okay! Get the hell out of here! That's a Goomba! You don't have any arms to throw that rock! Okay, so Flurry... You're a tank, so you stay in front and attack first, and then Mario can do a strong attack afterwards. I forgot to do stylish. All right, let's do spin jump. Oh, nine damage. That's really good. All right, his defense is up by three now, and my attack wore off, or, or my charge wore off. Attack flurry, please. I'm sorry, Flurry, but you're a tank. You're supposed to take hits for me. Um, again, I gotta do Body Slam. I'll switch out to Goose a bit later on in the fight. No, he did what all because his defense is... Yeah. Um, I... Since, since, okay, you know what? I can't do anything right now, so I'll just appeal and get more star power. All I can really do right now. Not too shabby, Gonzalez. You got showmanship. And that's gold in the biz. This here battle's just getting started. It's time I show you some real moves. Back in the day, I had so many drum kicking moves. So they had to make some illegal. Oh, now he's even buffer. He's huge. Defense went up by three. Holy crap. Oh my god, Jesus Christ, what is he doing? Okay, so he's halfway over. Um, I'm gonna try it. I don't think it'll do anything, but I'm gonna try it. At least I'll, I'll go for a stylish. Didn't get stylish, but it did something, I mean. Um, appeal one more time. Mario's not doing anything, but you know, I gotta do something. Defense went up by three. Gonna attack again. Oh no! Oh! I'm not even gonna try and counter that. I don't I don't know the timing at all. Um that's really really pricey. I don't wanna go for that. Let's try Koops. Let's see what Koops can do. HP's pretty low. He can actually shield Mario. I haven't shown that off. Should I? Uh you know what? Yeah, I'll shield Mario. Oh! It was alright, okay. Now I have a shell shield. Mario... You can do a normal jump. What the? I did the action command! So I, I didn't get any star points for that. Oh, that's great. And they're still trying to attack us. There you go, Koops. Get them. Good job, Koops. Alright, now... Just shell toss. Stylish, good. And, um... Let's see. Can we afford a, um... Earth number? No, we can't. Okay. Normal jump. <gasps> Thank you. She's helping us in this battle. I still can't believe... See... I gotta talk about more about, about, this, about this chapter, because I love this chapter so much. I just love the whole plot twist thing. Holy crap! Ten! I love this chapter so much. Like, I love the plot twist. I love the characters. Like, oh my god. Like, 
the whole time. My first time. Oh. My first time playing this, I thought it was actually Jolene who's the bad guy. I did not suspect Grubba at all, and thank you so much for that. I, you have no idea how much I actually needed that. Am I able to swap parts of it? Yes, I am. Okay. Goombelly, you haven't done anything yet. Let's get her out of here. Or out here, I mean. Special. Let's do Earth Tremor. All right, let's go. Goombella, you're here. Let's do it. Yes! Excellent. I believe, I believe that does five or six damage. I'm not sure. Six. Okay. It's getting weak. Urgh! I ain't finished yet, Gonzalez. Ain't over till it's over. That's the way it goes in combat sports, son. Let me tell you something. Fortune's gonna smile on me in the end, punk. Yeah, we'll see about that, Grubber. God, you're twisted, Jesus Christ. Oh, God. This guy is insane. I, I love this character so much. I just love how he turned out to be insane. I just... I, I don't have words for... I just love this so much. I, I can't even talk right now. I'm just so amazed. I hate this guy, but I love this guy at the same time. multi -bond. And that was not much of a multi -bond. All right. Um, I'll switch out Dez in a little bit. Just a little bit. Alright, what's he gonna do? Defense up. Oh, it's attacked both of us. And Mario's getting pretty weak. I need to heal really, like, I, I gotta heal now. Swap part. He's at 6 HP. Okay, Dez, get out here. Um. Crap. Oh, I. Th this is not good. I don't know what to do. Oh, I got. I'm actually, like, screwed now. Oh, God. I misclipped. I did not mean to do that. I meant to go back and I pressed A by accident. I knew it wasn't going to do anything. I got stylish, though. Okay. Oh, this is not good. I'm in a lot of danger right now. Oh, God. <gasps> Please don't. Oh, uh, uh, lucky. Oh, my God. Okay, we're safe. We're safe. We can heal now. We can heal. Okay. Let's heal really quickly, and then we're going to be good. Aim for Mario mostly, because Yoshi's, or Dez, I mean, is all right on HP. What the heck? Why wouldn't it work? That's weird. It wouldn't work for a second. Uh, game? Okay, I did flawlessly the first time, and now I'm... You know what? At least he's not dying this time. Now, this is for King K and Bandy Andy. You sick spike. Yar! That was for King K and Bandy Andy. We avenge them. And just like that, the battle is over. No! How did this happen? How could a perfect bond like mine lose to such a chub? Oh, great Gonzalez. Great fight there, son. Great fight. Ugh. Mr. Champion! Oh, no, I mean Mario. Please allow me to offer my earnest thanks for defeating that foul grubber. Jolene! I really have to apologize. I'm so sorry I had to get you involved. But you must understand, I had to learn the truth about Ms. Arena by any means, or Arena. Let me tell you everything. I had a little brother once. His name was Mush. He'd have done anything for me. Our family was always poor, so he became a fighter here to support all of us. But suddenly, he went missing one day. Our whole family was insoluble. I suspected foul play, so I got hired as the manager and investigated in secret. As I looked for clues about my brother, 
I accidentally saw Mr. Groba transform. So seeing what I was up against, I almost gave up hope. And then you appeared. So I decided to secretly guide you. Aha! So our ex-buddy was... Correct, it was me. Once I saw you fight, I knew the only one who could challenge Grubba. Now, sir. No, not sir, Grubba. I want answers right now. What'd you do to my precious little brother? You know exactly what I'm talking about. The first champion, Prince Mush. Prince, Prince Mush, he, he discovered my secret, my power sucking machine. I had him disappear. Any which way you look at it, uh, he ain't around these parts no more. No, I, I suspected as much. Oh, poor sweet Mush. Boy, I thought she was kind of mean, but turns out she was just worried for her brother. Wow. Check it out, Gonzalez. The Crystal Star. Whoa. Is this... Am I back in the Glitz Pit? Mush! Oh, is that really you, sis? What are you doing here? I... I was... I was just... There, there, Mush. It's okay. It's all over. Finally. Is that what Crystal Stars can do? Now, Mario. The Crystal Star is yours. We did it, guys. Whoa! Are you sure? It's okay if you can just take it? It's better if you have it. It's nothing like this can ever happen again. It's all you, Gonzalez. Nab it, dude. Oh, yeah. You got a crystal star! Your star power is now four, and Mario learned power lift. End of chapter. That was a great chapter. That was my favorite chapter of all time, and I really, really enjoyed it. Like a story, look, a story like this could like, honestly, it could be used for a whole game, like as like the entire game. Like a story that good. I hope you guys like. So for those of you who are watching this completely like a blind I hope you guys enjoyed that plot twist because that was the first time I played this I was absolutely excuse me amazed by this and yeah I loved every minute of it it was absolutely crazy we beat Grubba our we thought that he was a friend the whole time but no nope, he was nothing but a crooked like just monster what he was doing was inhuman it was disgusting and we avenged our friends. Unfortunately, we did lose a few people. King K and Bandy Andy. Unfortunately, they are gone now. And um, yeah, it sucks that it has to be that way, but at least we avenged them and they went out peacefully. Actually, no, they didn't. <laughs> I'm sorry. But anyway, I'm gonna end it off here because it's been recording for a little bit. We're at like almost half an hour, so I'm gonna end it off here. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Paper Mario. Paper Mario, Thousand Your Door. And if you guys enjoyed, please don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, favorite, and comment me. What was your reaction to finding out that uh, Grubbo was actually the main, like, bad guy the whole time? Me? I was absolutely, like, my jaw was, like, on the floor when I found out. And I was, like, what, 11? So, yeah. Now you know why I love this one so much. And don't worry, the game, trust me, the game gets a lot better. From this point on, the game gets so much more better story-wise, character-wise, it gets a lot better. So for those of you who are watching blind, get ready. It's going to get really good now. This is just the beginning. And with that all said, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys in the next episode. See you later, guys, and don't forget to have an amazing day.